You're never gonna make it. You're not good enough. There's a million other people with the same stuff. You really think you're different, man? You must be kidding. Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it. It's impossible. It's not probable. You're responsible. Too many obstacles. Who's good potato spin leak here and last time I fucked up and uh <laughs> so whenever I reloaded this game uh I was actually still on day twelve. It was just the day started. Um so yeah, I accidentally had Pavel cook a meal for himself and uh Bruno ate something out of the fridge. Uh, aside from that, we're still pretty gold. This time around I'm actually gonna go to the discrepant squat with uh with food. So let's see. Uh we're gonna take the one bit of canned food. And just in case he's already dead, we'll take the crowbar, because we can rummage through his goodies. Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, no, last time around, uh, Bruno was smoking all my motherfucking money. I think I was able to hold him uh, back from it this time around. Because uh, as soon as I put everyone down to bed, I switch over to Bruno, and I literally just ran around in circles. Hello? Squatter? Where you at, my dude? You in the basement? Yeah, sorry about that. You alright? Oh god. He's dead. Uh... So, hey. Who are you? You kill him? Oh, you got your eye on me, huh? that so I'll tell you what I'll get revenge for my buddy fuck you what's up yeah go upstairs you piece of shit you fucking killed my homeless buddy get down here don't you walk away from me all right he's gone well fuck okay let's run to homeless guys things is he gone or is he still hanging out? He's still fucking hanging out. Tell you what, let's beat him over the head with a crowbar. Alright, target cycle is L2, R2 is attack. Got it. We're getting revenge. Come on, you motherfucker, come down here. This is for my homeless bro. Do you really find it like this, huh? I don't trust you. You're being really aggressive. I'll tell you what. I'm just gonna scavenge for now. You try anything, I'm gonna bash your fucking head in. Yeah, me asshole. Don't you try shit. You try shit, I'm gonna fuck you all the way up. Fucking piece of shit. I mean, to be fair, all he did was you know, kind of be here. So let's break this open real quick. It shouldn't belong to anyone anymore, because the owner's fucking dead, but... Eh. Well, that's a shame. We weren't able to help him. Now, he said a few days. It was only one day. I'm gonna grab all that shit. Thanks. What's up? You aren't gonna start shit, are you? Ooh, I'm so tempted to just bash you in the back of the head. You know what? No, we're not gonna do that. We're just fine. Dead dude. Loot! We all got loot. It's all good. Dead dude's dead. We got loots. We all goods. Okay, so let's go ahead and divvy up what we want. I'm gonna come back here with a hacksaw or some shit. I don't know exactly what happened. None of my business. It's all good. Dead dude is dead. Nothing I can do about that. I get to keep my food. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of a little bit of this wood because I don't really need it. I don't really need you. Oh, we got some roll-ups, man. They're fucking... I'm gonna grab these parts. What else we got down here? Um, oh, it's it's literally just wood. So we got water and sugar and like a couple of parts. Uh, I'm gonna put these casings away for now so I can get the extra parts. Good stuff. Should I? You know what? He's not attacking me. I'm gonna leave him the fuck alone. I'll come back, okay? If I come back and you're fucking shit up, I will kill you. Wait, what's the upstairs looking like? We got until four to get out. Don't start shit, bro. That's that's not a fight you want to be a part of. It's not really one I want to be a part of either. I need a saw for this. So that saw, there's got to be shit in there. So I'm gonna have to go trade medicine with that uh, with that family. The question is, are they at the garage? Can I go to the garage? Okay, I'll trust you. 
Trust you not to be a dick. It's all fine. So we got a bunch of cigarettes. We got a little bit of moonshine for a trade. We, we're looking pretty sweet, and we get to keep our canned food? Fuck yeah. The only downside is now that the homeless man is dead, we're probably going to take uh, some, some damage to our mood. So, fuck. And we can always go to the church, see if they want to trade anything. Day 13. Well, what the fuck ever. People are dying. Things are exploding. We got three people who are complaining nonstop. At least we weren't attacked in the night. Okay, so you're very hungry. You're hungry. You're hungry. Yeah, okay, so we're going to have you grab something to eat. Now we're running low on food. Uh, we're going to have to make that the priority for, tri for trading. And you're going to go to sleep. I'm going to have Bruno immediately go to sleep because I don't need him smoking all my money. He can fucking suck a dick. Don't you break that bed. You fucking suck a dick with that. Okay, you went ahead, you ate your food, you get some sleep, I'm gonna have Papa work on shit. Do 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 Well, lucky it's not cold. You're damn right, and I can't wait to build a fucking furnace. Alright, take a look at shit. Um... What can you build? No! 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 We're gonna build, uh, can we do the... We can't do the herbal garden yet, that would be pretty fucking interesting. Uh... Let's make two filters, because I'd like to keep the water flowing. If I can't get food, I'll at least get water. After that, we'll take a look around at shit that we could potentially craft. I'll probably just hold on to parts for as long as possible. I think tonight we need to find a new area to loot. So we're either going to find a new area to loot, or we're going to try to take some meds. We have some meds, not too many. I'd like to get a couple more, so maybe we should stock up on food and meds before we try to do any trading. And who knows, maybe we'll just find a saw in the in the big mix, you know, why not? We might just come across it. Could be cool. Not that, but we're about to trade for shit? Fuck yeah, so... Oh, t Marco! You got nothing to say about the dead homeless man? You're fucking stone cold, dude. Jace! Whoever that dude was, he made a magic trick. Or, he did a magic trick, he made a fucking homeless person disappear. It's weird, because the shape was still in the sheet, but it's fine, it's fine. At least there was no blood anywhere. He starved to death, so... It's whatever. I'm probably just going to make people run in circles unless something happens. I might get an event. Uh, I'm not seeing too much happen up here. We don't really have anything to board up. Oh, right, I was going to take a look at shit. Um, we can take a look at the mail bench and all sorts of other crap. Let's see if there's anything uh, we can craft. We can do more roll-ups. I... I've spent way too many parts on roll-ups, so let's leave it alone. Um, let's take a look over here at the mail bench. Okay, so we could get we could get another shovel and another crowbar. How much would it take to upgrade you? Ooh, God. Okay. Okay, I'll just go ahead and accept that. Not really much else I can do except for wait on a trader. So, uh, if we get any more events during the day, I'll be back. I'm still saying we should just take that tank. We should take that tank, just like pull it into the house. Someone knocks on the door, we open it up. The first thing they see is the barrel of that motherfucker. Ooh, that'd be good. I love that. So far, nothing. But then again, it's only been an hour game time and roughly 15 seconds since I stopped recording. So, yeah, it yeah, is what it is. Just gonna be running back and forth until motherfuckers decide what. Oh, there you go, you little bitch. Uh, we're gonna have to have a talk. Bruno, we're gonna have to have a motherfucking talk. I'm gonna have to run around with sir. <laughs> I'm gonna have to run around in circles with you every single fucking day. Okay, you get out of that fucking chair, you fat piece of shit. Let's see how much you smoked. God damn, I had 24 of these! Oh, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Ooh. <laughs> oh, you, you fucker. I'm gonna be running you in circles non-stop. You better enjoy that shit. Guess what, fatty? You're running laps all day, every motherfucking day. The moment you wake up from your stupid little fucking nap, guess what you're doing? Yeah. Every single time, until you stop smoking all my motherfucking money! Alright, so lesson learned. Basically... Get on guard duty, you fat sack of shit. So basically... Invest heavily in moonshine. If you have a smoker, and if you have an alcoholic, invest heavily in smoke, in, uh, in cigarettes, I guess. Alright, let's figure out where the fuck we are going. Uh, so there's weapons and some parts, lots of materials at the decrepit squat, and it's all behind that one room. 
if we go ahead... I don't want to go to the supermarket. That scares me. The garage. Can't get there due to fighting. Okay, so the fighting moves. So, we have two options. We can go to the supermarket or St. Mary's Church. I'm going to go to the church. Some food, lots of materials, meds, uh, parts, possible trade, uh, but caution is advised. St. Mary's Church is still a uh, meeting place. Um, Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a crowbar and I'm going to take the shovel and I'm going to take all these cigarettes. Because fuck Bruno. All the smoke. I'm taking it. Let's go. Uh, Bruno's not touching the alcohol without me telling him to. But that, oh god, he just, he's burning through my fucking money. I need to get something out of this. Alright, so let's take a look around. Let's see what's here. Uh, okay, so noted there are some parts there. Cool. Hello? Let me look in here. Okay, so the big thing is, in areas like this, you need to avoid stealing anyone's personal property. It's a dangerous thing, it happens a little too often. So let's find someone we can trade with. Bloody vermin, okay. We have been robbed recently, so you have a uh, little left. Alright. Sorry to hear that. Flock seems we need the church, please do not disturb them. Alright, I'll stay right here. I'll trade with you. Alright, so, ooh, you got, um... You got a little bit of medicine, a little bit of food, you got water, you got parts, that's cool. Let me go ahead and load up all these cigarettes. I'm gonna get what I can out of it. Okay, first things first, give me them veg. Very generous of me. Cool. Glad you think so. Because I don't. Uh, we need the uh, we need the parts and we need water. The water we can produce over time. So these parts are a little bit rare for us. Oh fuck you, man. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. What about the what about the water? Hmm. Ooh, I can get two water. I'll take that. So what I'm seeing is. Cigarettes really aren't worth the investment. I get more out of moonshine. Um, so that, that's going to be the focus. I got vegetables, two parts, and two water. Like, seriously? Word? Alright, let's do this. I'll take that deal. I'll grab what I can from up here. I'm not going to bug your flock. But if I do get a gun, I'm coming back and I'm unleashing the motherfucking DACA. It's starting to get serious. I will murder everyone in here in one night, steal everything you have, put it in a separate container, and come back and pick through it over the other nights, after I give them like two days to chill out, alright? I'm not afraid. I will fucking murder. Alright, let's get the fuck out. What a waste of an evening. Oh, right, fucking stupid. Alright, didn't get much, got a little bit of edge, and Bruno's gonna be pissed. He's like, man, yeah, all the cigarettes are gone. That was our money, you fat fuck. You smoking all my money. What you doing, smoke my money, bitch? Yeah, you didn't even ask permission. Damn, that's my stash. Fat fuck. Well, at least now I don't have to run laps with fat ass McGee anymore. We've been raided. And they still can't get past our two dudes. I am fine with that. Hungry. Very hungry. Literally, you two are the only ones eating. What you got to say? It was tough, but women live on the street and took blah, 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 blah. They were always clean, wore the best clothes. I didn't want to lay in a It looked as if they were waiting to visit the theater. Ha! 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 Hmm. Hey, Bruno, you fat fuck, you want to cook something for everybody? You know what? Yeah, you... You were up late last night. You can... You should go ahead and rest. Bruno's fat ass will join you momentarily. you would be like, damn. Fine ass damsel. Alright. Pavel, get the fuck up the... You slow-moving bitch. At least the garage had good shit, you know? 
They had a saw and food and ammo. Like that that was the shit. When was the last time? Yesterday! Jesus, you need help, dude! Fuck! It's not that fucking serious, dog! I mean, here's the thing. I smoke. I don't get that fucking upset. I don't- I certainly don't bitch about it. I certainly don't act like it was a fucking attorney ago. Oh, hey, we got mercy. Okay. Bruno, come here. Don't you dare- don't you dare trade all of our moonshine for a cigarette, you fat fuck. Alright? Don't you dare do it. Yo, yo, what's up? Alright, so let's see what that- that got a lot of pots and food and shit. Oh, I want that food! Let's see what we can offer. Let's, um... Let's offer up the moonshine. What do I want for this? Well, I first of all, I want you to bend over backwards and give me that fucking food. I want this canned food. Very generous. It won't do. Try harder. Well, let me get all this crap food and then get rid of the canned food. Won't do. Try harder. Well, let's see what one bullet does. Two bullets. Fine, we can have a deal. Damn. You little bitch. You tried to rob me. Here, have some coffee, you fat fuck. Fine, we get him deal. Me, 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 me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It won't do. Try harder. What about the veggies? You want to give me the veggies? Listen here, you little slut. That's two fucking bullets. That's two people dead. Or two kneecaps gone. I'll tell you what. I'll take those off the fucking table since you want to be a little bitch about it. And, uh, you know, I'll, I'll give you a book. How's that? Here's a book. You don't want a book? Why don't you want a book? Are you that fucking stu- Are you that fucking illiterate, Franco? Look at those fucking dead eyes. He looks like a Muslim Snoop Dogg. What the fuck, dude? Like, do, do, you, do you not the, know the value of good literature? Here, To Kill a Mockingbird. Have fun, my dude. Oh, A Tale of Two Cities. There you go. For Whom the Bell Tolls. Have fun with that one. Oh, this one's perfect for you. The Picture of Dorian Gray. Have fun. Listen here, you fucking slut. You, you need to start giving me what I want. I'm going to take all these books back. Fucking, I'm going to take my coffee back, too. Oh! Oh! Now you're offended! I, I take away your coffee, and suddenly you're offended? Really? Really, dog? Alright, let, let me tell you. I don't need your fucking veggies. Oh! Oh, really? Let me give you, uh... I'll I tell you what. Bullets won't good. Uh, I'll give you an empty shell casing. I'll give you two! No? Well, god damn, dog, what the fuck is your problem? You really don't like doing this, do you? Uh, let's see, I got my fuel, I got my sugar, I can make more moonshine, I can make a lot more moonshine. You know who's not gonna be getting any of that moonshine? Well, you're gonna be getting that moonshine, I'm gonna tell you that right now. Y you know, Muslim Snoop Dog, it's, it's, it's pretty cool, um... What I'm gonna do, what if I just gave you this, uh, this homegrown tobacco? All right, a little bit of that, and uh, let's see if I can just go ahead and I, I can't get any of this other shit from you. Let's see about a little bit of water. Let's see. Um... Okay, so can I? I can have three food and three water for two moonshine and four tobacco. I'm not happy about that, dog. I'm really not. That's 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 a little that's a little much. Let me take one away. Oh, oh, so you need both. You need both. Tell you what, I'll give you a shell casing. Really? What would happen if I gave you a bullet right now, huh? Let, let me... Oh, we can have a deal! What, you're finally willing to... What, what if I give you a knife? Oh, really? You want the knife? You want the fucking knife. That, that's, that's, that's what you're, that's what you're talking about. I'll tell you what. I'll give you a knife. And two moonshine. Why don't you give me this canned food? Really? You, you would rather... You would shun me. It's a very generous offer. What about these veggies? Oh, you're gonna shun me again! Oh, you keep this shit up. We're not gonna have a deal at all, motherfucker. You, uh, you need to chill the fuck out. Let me tell you what. You have two moonshine. I'm gonna give you a bullet. Two bullets. You're not getting three bullets. No. No, you're not getting three. Let me take that away. I'll tell you what. I'll, get, I'll give you that. I'll give you that wacky tobacco. Okay? You walk away with that. And next time you show up, we'll just pretend we get along, okay? I'm not gonna want to punch you in the face. No. Uh, well, yes, technically I need you to fucking leave. So, bye. 
fucking piece of shit. Fucking asshole! I hate that guy! God! I definitely need to make more fuel, though. I should have brought a hatchet! I should have. I have a lot of wood. I can make fuel. You know what? Today's fuel day. That's what it is. It's fuel day. That's what we're doing. We're making a bunch of fuel. Uh, first things first, though. Let's see just how much moonshine we're wanting to make. So, I currently have zero. As far, I have 12 water. I have 13 sugar. I have 7 fuel. Uh, so, that's half of our water uh, for 2 moonshine. But we're about to get 4 back. We don't use a lot of water on the day to day. The biggest issue there would be if someone decided to steal from us spontaneously. So, I I'm gonna I'm gonna set that aside for now. Whenever one of you fucks makes up, you're making a bunch of fuel. You're you're gonna be making fuel or upgrading something. Maybe you can upgrade something. You know what? Let's take a look at what can be upgraded. What about our metal bench? We just traded a knife, didn't we? Did we trade a knife? Oh no, he pissed me off too much to get the knife. I don't think you'll ever get the knife. Let's go ahead and upgrade this. It's gonna cost pretty much all the parts we have, but. I do want to see what we get, and knowledge is is the real power of games like this. So as soon as I know, I know. So we we're gonna be going on that front. Hey, perfect timing. Why don't you get started on fuel, dude? You should have plenty of wood. All right, what are you gonna turn to fuel today? What are we burning? We do. Uh, well, we got plenty of wood out, you know, out and about. So let's go ahead and just say. Oh, it's one per? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and do eight fuel then. I'm happy about that. Uh, you done upgrading this? Let's see what you can make. Okay, so now we can make guns! Okay. Oh, we can make a saw? We don't need a trade for it? Well, we need broken weapon parts, though. We can make a hatchet now. We can make a helmet. We need that broken helmet, though. Hmm. This is all stuff to look forward to. The, the most, the greatest likelihood is gonna be the saw blade. That's going to be really useful to have. Uh, I, Bruno, I think it's time you got a little bit of sleep. You've been a little bit cranky ever since talking to Franco. I am going to sip my coffee. Well, let's just review what we have. We have enough medication to scrape by without really reserving any for trade. Uh, we've got food for almost a week. We've got enough water to, to pass, especially since right now stuff's happening. Uh, we're distilling some moonshine right now, which means we're going to be ready to trade. The It looks like the munition is not going to be that useful until way later on. If we were to come across another knife, we'd be in business. So that's cool. There's a the question. Whenever I'm using tools or anything that could be used as a weapon, whenever it breaks, does that give me broken weapon parts? So that'd, be an, that'd be a nice little thing to have. Pavel, man, you rest up quick! Let me tell you what, you can stand here and watch the moon shine. You wanna watch the moon shine, Pavel? Go ahead and watch the moon shine. Let the moon shine to steal, just let it take you away on a magical journey, man. I'll tell you what, you can sit in this chair, too. Marco, you almost done? I'm gonna have you, I'm gonna have you listen to the radio, dude. Alright, let's go listen to the radio, let's see what they got going on. They ain't got anything special. What's going on in the world today? Oh, I missed it. Uh, recent shortages, prices of cigarettes and tobacco have become exceedingly high. Many people need cigarettes to calm down. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Well, it seems like they're virtually worthless last night. Might just be the person I was trying to. It's cool outside. Okay, so it's starting to cool down. Which means I definitely need to build a furnace and start stockpiling fuel. So that's next on the list. Let's see exactly what we need for a furnace. Uh... Simple heater. All we're, all we're missing is 18 parts. And after that, we can kind of forget about the distillery. Not the distillery. We can forget about uh, the rain catch for a bit. Because we're going to be melting snow during the winter. Pavel! I said you're supposed to be harvesting the moonshine. God damn. You blind already? You been drinking our supply? Mm. Alright. I'll see you when the night comes. So we're looking for... Wood, parts, food, water, a bunch of other shit. And it looks like we got some new locations, so let's take a look at the shelled school. Uh, school was damaged by 
Mortar shells, no class is held for a long time. We're a group of rebel militia men and moot. Ooh, fuck that. Fuck that. A uh, small apartment building. We can't go there, but it's nice to know what they have. Uh, old apartment building used to be owned by an elderly couple and their son fled before the siege. There are rumors that some shady looking well armed. Okay. Okay. I get it. Okay, so everything's gonna. Let, let's take a look at the hotel. If, if the pattern is ringing true, uh, the small yellow luxurious hotel previously owned by a travel agency recently occupied some armed thought. Yeah, motherfuckers are armed now, so we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to start, um, being a little bit aggressive, unfortunately. Let's take a look at the supermarket. Uh, supplied the whole neighborhood before later turned into a war zone. Since there is a um, military control, it might be dangerous. The groceries still might be worth the risk, as there should be a lot of goods left. Oh. Okay, I know. Uh, if an update didn't change it, I know an event that happens here. And I need to be careful of it. Because it could be game-ending, virtually. <laughs> if I'm not careful, it could be fucking game-ending. Especially since all I have is a fucking crowbar, a hatchet, and a shovel. If I'm gonna be doing something stupid like that, I at least want to be, I don't know, somewhere a little bit more reasonable? Uh, God. So, the question is, do we go for the decrepit squat, or do we visit the shelled school? We can also just go straight to the supermarket. Okay, so, ah, God, the thing about the supermarket... There, there's an event that happens that gives you an opportunity to loot the place, or you could intervene. If you don't intervene, is a big hit to your mood. You know what? Yeah. No. No, no, no. No. Yeah. Because if we can get the food, if we can get the food, we're good. If this doesn't pay off, we're fucked. So y'all guard, my hungry ass is gonna go. Alright? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the crowbar. Nothing else. Just the crowbar. And hopefully, I don't get my ass killed. I got a feeling in my gut right now, it's not good. <laughs> oh, this is gonna end poorly. Especially since I've never had luck with combat in this game. Alright, so let's take a quick look at this rubble. Alright, so we got parts and ammo and wood. I'm just gonna leave that there. We're gonna want to be a little bit sneaky. Okay, so yeah, you can pretty much assume what's about to happen in here. Uh, okay, oh, there's the weapon parts and some sugar and some tobacco. There's some good shit here. Okay, so she's just scavenging. And uh, this militiaman. Oh, yeah. Y'all can y'all can pretty much see where this is going. So this this is where it's iffy. Unless I can get the drop on him, this could end poorly for me. <sighs> no, hit him, hit him. Can beat the shit out. No, don't you do it. Beat the shit out. Of him. Fuck him up. See, that's the thing that sucks about combat is it's RNG. It is all RNG whenever you get close, unless you get the fucking drop on them. So Marco's dead. Oh shit. We lost the crowbar. And it's day 15, alright. So let's see that, yeah, everyone's gonna be bitchy about it. Yeah, 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 get over it. If we had a gun, that would have went very differently. Alright, go ahead and bitch. Marco was killed last night, I'm glad it wasn't me. Have to be careful, blah, blah, blah. Marco did not return from the scavenger last night, we will miss him. Blah, 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 fuck it, I'll tell you what, how about you motherfuckers get drunk? Don't get anything done today, just get fucking hammered. That's your evening. Get fucking sloshed. Get get fucked. Have fun with that shit. Like, get drunk and go to bed. Yeah. Go ahead. Come on down here and fucking take a nap or something. Oh, you're just gonna pass out on the floor? 
All right, you have fun with that. Like, yes, it's drunk. You need to sleep because you're gonna be scavenging tonight. Because I fucking killed Marco. Motherfucker! I just drank with you. God damn! Get down here and get some sleep. Yeah, close the door quietly. Somewhere over the rainbow, painted black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing, things didn't go so well. So, I guess... Oh, I'm just wondering what we need to do. You know, Pavel can try somewhere else tonight. It sucks. They had such good shit there. All I need to do... Here, here's the thing. In that situation, everyone can cry their eyes out. Hey, hey, you've had enough. You fuck, you had enough, Bruno. Go to sleep. Yeah, fuck. Okay, let's answer, we're, we're drunk, let's answer the door. Come on, Bruno, you fat, drunk fuck. Ah, come on. Who's at the door? Blah. Blah. Is that our neighbor? Blah. Blah. Hey, I'm, I'm coming, shut up! No! I'm going up to- I'm so drunk I'm going up the fucking stairs. The door's not upstairs. Yeah, what's up? Oh, I didn't mean- I didn't mean to ignore you, I'm sorry. Uh, Jill hit my time in the street. People are buried beneath the rubble. Please help me pull them out. Every pair of hands knew it. I'm drunk as fuck. Why not? Yeah, limp over and help them dig people out, you fat fuck. <laughs> oh, we just had to go help our neighbors. They were probably the same for us. Good. Good, good, good. None of them are stepping in now that Fucknuts is dead. God damn. So, now we can't scavenge tonight. <laughs> oh. The well, things I do to try to keep these fuckers safe. But basically, if we had let... If we had let the soldier rape her... Let, let's call it what it is. That, that is definitely a situation for rape. Uh, yeah, no. If we let the soldier rape her, we could loot all the supplies we needed. Uh, but because we decided to intervene and didn't have an optimal place to hide or didn't spot one initially, we fucking died. We got a good hit on him initially, but whenever you're doing the melee attacks without getting the jump on someone, it is pure RNG. There's no telling how it's going to end. Usually poorly. We just couldn't make up the damage and he was too heavily armored. It was a fuck up. But hey, it is what it is. That's right, limp your ass over here. You don't have anything to fucking build because your buddy's dead. I hope you enjoy that. Ooh, maybe you can get some water. You might have another filter. Let's watch your drunk ass install a filter. Nope. I'll tell you what, you can just sit in this chair and sober the fuck up. We'll be back in the evening. Motherfucker! We are too damn drunk to do anything aside from sleep! Alright. Let's we'll see what happens on day 16. The night was calm, luckily. Holy shit, you're very hungover. Ooh, you're very hungry and very tired. Let me tell you what, why don't you make a meal for both of yous, okay? Hey! Hey! Why are you still drunk? Holy fuck! What the fuck? Oh, shit! We don't have veggies! Oh, yeah, we don't have veggies. Alright, let's make two. Gonna have to. We got nothing else. Something tells me our playthrough's close to over. Think we did better than the last time around? Not quite sure. Motherfu- Where do you got Fucking cook! Yeah, I know you're dizzy. Your ass is cooking, though. Fucking make breakfast, bitch! Yeah, that's right. Dance at the stove. Dance at. Yeah. Get done. Hmm. 
We're helping the fuck out of our neighbors. We just lost our buddy. Freaking Bruno's still drunk after digging people out of a fucking collapsed building. Like... <laughs> hey! Cook! Why is it so damn difficult? You're not in the mood. You fucking cook it. Grab that fucking spatula, fat ass. Cook! What's up? Hey. What you need? What you want? Right. Thank heavens. I'm Daniel. This is Misha, my neighbor's kid. Could you take care of him for a few days? I promised I'd find... <sighs> yeah. Yeah, sure. Come on in, Misha. We're all very fucking depressed. The cook's drunk. Get back to cooking! Well, Misha, my name's Pavel. And we got Bruno. Yeah. And we got Bruno. He's drunk, so... You better be cooking. Fucking cook! Do you want to play? I'm not in the mood. Well, fuck you then, kid. Get inside. You fucking cooking? Nah, fucking cook! Everything's wrong. You saw it in you, you see friends, but you see them so You fucking, you better be fucking good cooking, bitch. Alright. Yeah, you'll see them soon. In hell! You pan Yeah, I fucking promise, kid. Uh, let's get your bio. Let's see, why don't you have a dog and dog? You're fucking annoying, kid. Fucking cook! God, not babysitting two idiots. Just doesn't it? It is taking. It's it's fucking noon. It's noon. You have two dishes to make. Fucking cook, you fat fucking pit. This is the only good skill you have. You chain smoking fat alcoholic. You fat alcoholic. Fuck. What the fuck? I'm almost tempted to let your ass start. Fucking, it's right there. Finish it. God, don't you fucking do it. You're not taking those pills, you fat sack of shit. You're gonna eat this meal. You're gonna go. To, you're gonna eat this meal and you're gonna go downstairs. Fucking eat, you fat fucking piece of shit. Okay, let me tell you what. Uh, fuck you. The kid can eat. The kid can fucking. That, that's gonna sit on the stove, you fat sack of shit. You're sad. Well, god damn it, aren't we all, kid? Tell you what, why don't you take a nap? You want you fucker. You fucking worthless fuck. You're gonna fucking start to death. The, I'm gonna laugh. Ugh, you're gonna start to death in your sleep, and I'm gonna be fucking laughing. Hey, kid, you want something to eat? Let's go ask for food. Let's eat something hot off the stove. Hey, can we eat that? I'm not, I'm not. I don't need it. I just want it. Cause Bruno's a little bitch. I'm gonna go play on the swing. Can someone push me? No? I'm gonna go in my treehouse and cry because my dead parents and dead fucking dog. Yeah, you do that, kid. I'm just gonna be over here, hungover, waiting for a merchant. It's 420! I wonder where the fuck Franco is! Yeah, damn fucking Middle Eastern ass Snoop Dogg looking motherfucker. Fucking glaze over eyes, big ass fucking glasses, stupid fucking hat, fucking mussy fucking patchy ass beard, stupid little fucking glazy eyed bitch, tiny ass nose, big lip hat motherfucker. You humming? Oh, Misha's so cute. Well, on the bright side, things can't get any worse. Tune to the next episode where things get worse. Like, comment, subscribe, keep on keeping on. I will see you there. It's going to be a long way to hell.